All right. Let me give you a story. So back in 2012, when I was a little kid who lived like in the middle of nowhere, most of the people in my area were old or they didn't play any games. So I kind of wanted to find some people who, you know, did. I took to the internet and through a 1999 laptop and very slow connection, that would take you like five minutes just to search up something like <clears throat> balls. I then stumbled upon a game called Adventure Quest Worlds where I, you know, had loads of fun killing monsters, chatting with the locals, and just grinding up my character through their ranks. But then, over a few years, it seemed like AQW was starting to act like, uh, this. <laughs> alright, alright, settle down my pawns. So, we all know that the game is very funny. Indeed. It has good combat. Right, right, right. And the best part is, everyone loves it. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yeah. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Yeah. Yeah. Well, I don't. <laughs> but, sir, what, what about the game? Uh, the, the fans won't like hearing this. They won't know if you all keep your trap shut. I want money. I demand for money. And if I can't get it, then no one will. Money Grim. <laughs> yes, sir. Fetch me the one that they call Swag Bro and bring him here. Uh, well, uh, actually, you know, I, I remember about this, but uh, I think his name was something like a Game Boy 1 3D2 or something like that. Please. Uh, I don't think it was Swag Bro. Please, though. please, just shut up. Or I won't feed you tonight, and you will be sleeping in the chamber. No, no, please, don't, don't, I'm sorry. Uh, please don't sit me down there again. Not again, please. <laughs> I tried to be nice. I really did. But after seeing results like this, I think it's time to take our ideas into a much different approach. Anyways. If you all don't want to be like him, then understand that this is about sending a message to the free-to-play people. It's time for you to stop living on food stamps and get a job. Oh gosh golly jeepers. Man oh man, B, that boss surely was fun. I can't wait to get into some of that sweet delicious loot. Hello, brothers of swag. Uh, hi. Seems like you're having fun, are you? Why, yes. Yes, I am. Well, I hate to inform you, not really that things from now on will be more different on the money side. Here is this non-legally abiding contract for you to sign it to. And uh, what this do? Oh, nothing really. Just some silly little costumes, and some mounts, maybe a few skin changes to your weapons. Just little stuff like that. Oh, <laughs> okay. Well then, sign me up. <laughs> Thank you for being so foolish. It is not only costumes like everyone would like you to believe. It is also many weapons that will be more powerful than your regular ones. So now you can't even compete. And now you're heavily limited to what you can do. No. <laughs> Anyways, you're coming with me. Why is it dark in here? I'm sorry, what? Why is it dark in here? T take off the blindfolded mask. Gah. What's going on? What's happening? So, we finally meet. And you are... My apologies. Allow me to introduce myself. I am the head of AQW, who might one day see this and request for a takedown. What takedown? Oh, right. You're still a kid. And your channel doesn't exist yet. Well, anyways, I brought you here on the account of seeing that you have memberships. Even as you grow older, you still try to be cheap by buying the lowest purchases for subscriptions. And that's a problem because... Oh, food bro 87. How do you not see it? I do not need people who are poor playing my games. I need people who are wealthy and have money. You are playing on a laptop that is one year shy of being into the next century. Your connection is worse than a satellite dish in a black hole. And you can only play this game at your grandparents in their bathroom. I need people who are urbanized who can sustain an income and give it to me and only me. You, however, are a child and do not understand until you're older. Now disappear and bring me the current Stambro87. Uh, well, he's actually been here the entire time. What, what do, do you mean? mean? What do you mean? What do you mean? Why can't you say something like elaborate, please explain, or even a 
What are you talking about? There are so many other words to simply ask when you don't understand or comprehend. Yep, yep, yep. Is that all you do is just speak and flap your lips around just so you can get everyone's attention? Enough of your TikTok brain rot hotshot wordplay. That kind of dialect really leads me astray. Bars. Especially from you. Educate yourself and learn more words because I'm tired of being in the dungeon and being punished harshly just for simply giving an unbiased opinion. The way you treat us is too inhumane. And so with that being said, I unregrettably resign from my position. What do you... <clears throat> Fine. If that is how you feel, then you are free to go. I don't need someone like you holding my company down. Actually, we're all leaving. We don't like your business around here. <laughs> Boy, I don't need any of you leeches thinking you can get all this golden blood. I will simply take my company and start a new empire in 3D! How do you like that, L? This is my perfect victory! Almost as much as how the numbers are doing for that game. Oh, but it won't fall. Mm-hmm. I hope you can say that now. But that'll be for a different time. It's you. Darn right it's me. Seems like you convinced my past self to stop playing your game. Well, I'll tell you, I did retry it again. And I was hit with the same stuff. Though admittedly, I do like that now. And I can actually talk to people instead of having them greasy chats. Oh, come on, food bro. I meant swag bro. It's me. I let you have so many good times. I got you through those many lonely moments at home and even let you get some of those membership weapons to play with. And like Magnifico, this is the thanks I get? This is how you treat your highness? Your king? Your fellow? This dude here. Look bro, aside from both of those looting me in the same thing, you want my actual and honest opinion? Fine. I just think your game was good. I'm a sucker for random and obscure references, so, you know, I love that. Uh, gameplay was good. A little grindy, but, you know, manageable. However, is this really how you want the game to go down? To just a forced paywall to even change your faction of being good or evil? As a kid, I clicked through, and I accidentally chose the bad path. I know, and I said, Ooh. And the only way to change back was through your membership. So tell me. If it is only just cosmetics and skins, then how do you explain these moment-defining parts where I actively need to pay real-life currency to do something as basic as changing factions? You and everyone else is on Fraud Watch. If you were like your employees, then you better make like a horse and gallop along to another pasture before I lasso this thing down. This dude is just the worst. You think you're going to accomplish anything with posting this video? You're only going to get people mad at you. Also, satire seems a little strong for how far you're going to go with it. Swag, bro. You're not seeming to really be swag about yourself. Nice way to make people see your teen-friendly content by showing them SMT, fan-made raps, cringy dialogue, a Roblox Let's Play attempt. Seems like you're trying to find any way just to find a fan base or even just to stay relevant. I don't know what your end goal is, but is this really what you want? A whole fan base of people that you love so dearly as a kid, talking to, and even a join to play with, now fighting against you? Is this how you want to be known on this platform of YouTube? Is this how you want to be known? Just a dude with bad opinions who gets loads of impressions, but no watch time or long retention that doesn't even make it past 30 seconds? What do you have to say to that, Food Stamp Bro 87 You know what I love about being a small creator? That no matter how many times I cry myself to sleep, wishing and dreaming to be known, to inspire someone else, or to even just make one friend on here, or to even just have a good time with my quote-unquote non-existent fan base. What I mainly love about never being in the spotlight in my life is that you can't really be called out because no one knows you. I don't have any restraints on me as I'm free to post wherever content I want because though no one watches me now, Gohan, there will be someone who will come and take that place and eventually will one day see my content for once and for all. However, I'll never know that person or see that person if I don't try. No! My money! No pawns. No dinero. I have nothing. It's all your fault! Listen to yourself! You have blamed everyone, but you have never thought about yourself and the possibility of being part of the problem. I am indeed a villain. But you, sir, are the real monster here. What don't you understand? You could have been the coolest dude in the nation, or the hippest cat in creation, but since you ain't good friends, then nothing's worth the fuss, my guy! What are you saying? It's time to make a change to this, to make it better. So like Marth, let's do it together! 
together. And so, the boss man made up with his employees, started paying everyone fairly, and ultimately built the game back up to its glory. Until we got word of some actual controversies that were happening about the pay, and then I realized somehow this stupid skit I had was actually going through the company. Like, this is actually me genuinely speaking, I actually was joking, I promise you all, like, like real talk, keep it on the down low, let's say, heads up, 7-0. I was actually, you know, I'm actually being serious, I really didn't, so, um, yeah. However, in the Swag B universe, though, the game slowly closed down within the later years. But, even though the game was down, his once pawns, now friends, would go get food, play games, and enjoy themselves and their company. And that is the conclusion of this video. Thy end. Well, uh, that surely was something. <laughs> uh, if you made it this far somehow, then uh, subscribe and like to get more stuff like this. And for all those who stuck around, this is me being in the laboratory making more works like this. And with that being said, beware and take care.